Welcome back, Virgo. Thank you guys for being here. So we're going to jump right in. This is for Virgo. Virgo, this is for you. For Virgo. Virgo, this is for you. Some of you guys could be going out with friends. Others of you, there could be a reconciliation on the way. We'll see where this is going. And some of you guys, there's a lack of communication, no communication between you and someone here. There could be unexpected communication that comes through or something unexpected that happens. Some of you guys, there could be blocked communication or just defensiveness around communication. Yeah, some of you guys, it's unexpected communication, especially if things were stuck. Some of you guys could be dealing with a Scorpio. are dealing with somebody that could be in and out I think somebody does want some type of reconciliation some of you guys have a very physical thing with this person ace of swords at the bottom of the deck there could be some clarity for some of you guys this energy of either multiple energies or a reconciliation that perhaps somebody's worried about I, th I think for some of you guys somebody wants to make something better um, or come out of this energy of um, that three of swords somebody's not really sleeping well at night for Virgo is that nine of swords again some of you guys there's an energy of i think some of you guys walk away some of you guys could have emotionally detached from the situation and it's leaving somebody kind of in their head like kind of worried maybe this person's worried that you're done with them i think there's a lot of emotional fulfillment for some of you guys that could be like a family situation involved that's involved here for Virgo. this person could be coming towards you slowly it could be an earth sign like yourself mm. there could be multiple people coming towards you so I guess there needs to be an energy of balance maybe somebody's experiencing the karma Maybe somebody wants to compromise or make, make things right. I won't take this Empress, but it does look like maybe there wasn't no, there wasn't any growth. Could have been like a lot of waiting here. For some of you guys, yeah, this thing could be coming back around. Maybe somebody's making a decision. Maybe maybe somebody's um, seeing things clearly. If this ended, I feel like it. It's uh, you have the death card. So for some of you guys, it's a Scorpio. Some of you guys, there's a rebirth of the situation. Some of you guys could have your guards up. Some of you guys, maybe one person is more focused on finances, and somebody could just be very attractive. Maybe this person's busy. Some of you guys are dealing with a fire sign. 
I mean, you guys, there's like a lack of equal give and take. Issues with communication. Somebody's in and out, non-committal, most likely for some of you. Some of you guys, somebody released something. There's your energy, Virgo. It looks like some of you guys could have moved on, moved forward, because maybe this person was in and out. Maybe you're, maybe it's you. I don't know. Take it how it resonates. There is mutual love here, but I guess somebody wasn't taking things too serious. There was just a lot of physical attraction. Maybe somebody prioritized other things over the connection. For Virgo. Looks like there is going to be communication. Queen of Wands says the King of Wands. There's definitely a strong physical thing here. You guys could have a good sex thing. There could also be like another person involved. It came sideways, this Queen of Cups. Maybe somebody's, maybe somebody's unsure about their feelings. Maybe somebody's feeling emotionally vulnerable. Maybe there is another energy here. It could be a Pisces or a water sign. Or somebody could just be feeling like they're stuck to the situation. It looks like for some of you, um, somebody could be... Somebody could have been holding back, but I feel like there's still an energy of holding on. But it looks like maybe somebody is ready to make a decision. Or um, for some of you... Some of you guys could be dealing with a Gemini... There's some type of defensiveness with this communication. Maybe somebody comes off a little bit cold. Maybe somebody's holding on to more than one person. Yeah, I think somebody could be juggling here. This was also sideways, but we have another queen. We have several queens here. Some of you guys, somebody's, there could be something to do with finances for some of you. Others of you, there's something, um, uh, something about like somebody juggling either maybe a, like a wife or somebody. It could be an earth sign. Because clarifying the lovers is the queen of pentacles, two pentacles. Star, Aquarius energy. Maybe somebody needs to find some type of balance with um, different aspects of their life, like the material world. We have the stars, the tower. There is some type of growth here. There could be a decision. Something somebody doing something like kind of out of nowhere for some of you guys this is a divine counterpart or there could be a baby mother involved ace of swords ace of cups maybe somebody expresses how they feel some of you guys could be repeating a cycle or there could be something to do with time because Seven of Pentacles, there's like a waiting energy. And maybe it's maybe it's not moving as fast as somebody wants it to. Maybe that's why we have that Seven of Wands, Eight of Wands. For some of you, not all of you. There's that Eight of Wands. There's going to be communication. We'll do that again. Okay. 
Well, it looks like this communication comes after a period of waiting. Some of you guys, this could be around like Sagittarius season. Some of you guys are dealing with a Sagittarius or a Gemini. Some of you guys, somebody's manifesting something long term. Okay. What's the outcome for the situation? It could be like a lack of cooperation with this person. Or maybe somebody had a decision of who they want to commit to or something to do with commitment. Maybe somebody's distant, distant with somebody that they're committed with. There's that five of swords again. There's issues with communication or maybe somebody is trying to get away with something. Somebody could have been patient or somebody's dealing with a Sagittarius. Somebody could also be dealing with a Taurus. And we have the universe card, which is specific to this deck. Some of you guys, this is, I believe the universe card is like the world card. Um, learning from, you know, past, past experiences, using those past experiences to, um, to help you. To help you make you know better decisions some of you guys well we have the devil so uh, uh, are you guys learning i don't know <laughs> it could be very tempting so maybe the universe is gonna test you guys again the ace of pentacles yeah i think whatever this thing is there's a lot of temptation that's gonna be involved with it because maybe it looks like it's coming in um stable with the obstacle obstacle for Virgo. The obstacle is somebody's somebody has a lot of fear. And it could have to do with communication or the lack thereof. Or somebody's just maybe there's like a blaming energy. There's an energy of lack of equal give and take. Somebody could be breadcrumbing the whole situation. There could also be delays and just somebody spying, watching from a distance. And somebody's independence. And communication, clarity. What does this mean for Virgo? So you guys are going to be focused on your money, your material world. You've got the Phoenix. This is like the Fool card. Out of the ashes rises the phoenix. So you guys been through, you guys been burned before. The moon card. Somebody could be hiding how they, how they feel. Yeah, with the queen of cups. There's, you guys are gonna, perhaps keep your emotions to yourself. Hang, hang one. Um, very stuck energy. I think some of you guys are stuck to like the sexual stuff. Like, you feel emotionally stuck to this. I feel like there's, like, a lot of physical attraction here. And some of you guys could be repeating a cycle with this person. Okay. Some of you guys, two swords. I feel like some of you guys are, like, kind of pulling the wool over your eyes. Like, or you're, you're, not, seeing, you're not seeing things clearly. And, I don't know, maybe it's because somebody wants attention or somebody gives you attention or something like that. Um, then we have this waiting energy. I think this person has multiple people in their energy. Okay, I kind of, I'm kind of getting that. Or somebody could just be taking action. We have the two of cups. Okay, so somebody could just be taking action. You know, somebody's coming forward after a period of time. Um, but I do feel like there's a lot of physical attraction, and it's gonna make you feel stuck to this whole situation. Okay. Let's get you guys some oracles. For Virgo. Okay. So we have Genesis. We have the beginning. <laughs> Genesis is in the Bible, which is the first book of the Bible. 
um, which is about beginnings. So maybe there is a new beginning here with you and this person. Um, there, like I said, there is some type of temptation. Um, you guys got the card of protection. So I feel like even though there is temptation, I feel like, you know, you're still protected here. You have resentment. Maybe somebody's resenting you and I feel like it's because of the lack of communication. But with that tower here, I feel like it, this communication is going to be unexpected. And then we have um, truth and fairness, which is in reverse. And seeing how this devil was here and uh, I think we saw justice and stuff. What, where is it? Uh, I don't know where it is, but it is here. Here's justice. I feel like there was a lack of, maybe there was a lack of truth. We do have the card of clarity here, but you know, maybe things weren't balanced. Maybe things weren't fair. Six of Pentacles was in the the obstacle, you know? So either way, I feel like there's a new beginning here for you guys. Um, Ace of Pentacles is also in the outcome. Maybe there's a new beginning with this person that's very tempting for you. Um, yeah, that's what I have for you guys, and it's kind of getting along, okay? Um, bye!